yeah? Well, you tell that asshole Bonehub to get on the stage in his tux, or I'll find some other fucking monkey to do the job for him. You got that? Goodbye. It's time for You Don't Know Dick. Ladies and gentlemen, perverts of all ages, welcome to the first adult computer game show. The one where cock is king and quad is queen. And if you don't know your ass from a hole in the ground, then you don't know dick. Hey, how you doing? I'm Paco Lockhart, and uh, I'm the producer of the show. Uh, how many players we got here today? One? One lonely fucking player. Well, one's better than nothing. And now, let's bring out the host of tonight's sex extravaganza, the horniest man within the sound of my voice, the one and only one, Mr. Magnificent One, your host, Brad Bonehart. Thank you, thank you. You people are great. I fucking love y'all. No, really, I could. Really, you bunch of horn dogs. Well, here we are again, all set to play another game of You Don't Know Dick. But before we can go any further, let's bring out everyone's favorite piece of ass, our very own woman of infinite categories. Let's put it out, and who wouldn't want to, for the lovely Miss Stacy Valentine! Oops. <laughs> that always seems to happen. Why, yes it does. Stacy Valentine, everyone! Well, that could go on all night. But who's here for some dick? Well, all right then, let's do it. Johnny, send in the clowns. Rod, tonight's player one lives as a man on the eastern tip of the Texas panhandle and enjoys putt-pulling. Give a howdy to player one. Okay, people, listen up, because these are the rules for play. Player one, you get the B button. Second you hit your button, you'll be allowed to answer the question. At which point, you'll enter the corresponding letter for the correct answer. Of course, if you get the answer wrong, you'll hear this little sound. <coughs> Remember, players, hit your assign button when you know the answer to the question. Are you ready to play? Okay, let's dive into round one of Ya Don't Know Dick! <coughs> Player one, you make the call. Pick a category. You've picked... Porn stars! And this question is worth $1,000. Which of these titles is an actual porn film title? Amityville Horror, My Left Nut, Bad Girls, A Julie Rage in Harlem. Kick ass, player one! No good! Player one, you make the call. Pick a category. You've picked Dirty Jokes. And this question is worth $2,000. What kind of meat does a priest eat on Friday? Chicken, beef, pork, or none? Kick ass, player one. <laughs> Wrong! Player one, you make the call. Pick a category. You've picked historical fucks, and this question is worth $3,000. It is believed that the model who sat for Da Vinci's Mona Lisa was, in fact, a woman from Florence, Madonna, Gore Vidal, Da Vinci and Drag. Kick ass, player one. Ah! No good! Player one, you make the call. Pick a category. You've picked sex, literally. And this question is worth $4,000. If Robinson Crusoe were gay, what would he have called his companion Friday? Bend over, tall, dark, and endowed, Uncle Fister, little buddy. Player 
John's got it. <laughs> Wrong. Player one, you make the call. Pick a category. You've picked women. And this question is worth $5,000. What is the national percentage for women receiving oral sex in the USA? 80%, 69%, 40%? I don't know, but I'm sure it's not high enough. Take it, player one! Hey, what game are you playing anyway? Player one, you make the call. Pick a category. You've picked organic mechanics. And this question is worth six thousand dollars. What kind of rides do most women want to take? A bus ride? A ride to the moon? A bicycle ride? A mustache ride? Kick ass! Uh, hello? Hey, are you guys playing or what? A mustache ride. Get on board, baby! Where are we gonna head out into the sunset? Player one, you make the call. Pick a category. You've picked porno. This question is worth $7,000, and just to make it interesting, why don't we have our gorgeous hostess, Stacy Valentine, remove a piece of clothing for every question? How about that, studio audience? Which of these titles is an actual sci-fi porn film? Buck Rogers, The Cocketeer, Flesh Gordon, Blade Runner. Player One's got it. Flesh Gordon. Player One, you make the call. Pick a category. You've picked the in, out. And this question is worth $8,000. What's the biggest fallacy about blowjobs? That it's an acquired taste? Size doesn't matter. The I won't come in your mouth promise. You really don't blow, it's just an expression. Take it, player one! No good! Player one, you make the call. Pick a category. You've picked women. And this question is worth $9,000. Pity twisters, women who like to twist and tug at their own nipples, are identified by what two telltale physical attributes? A. Large breasts and long fingers. B. A hot and horny appearance. C. Extra long eraser length pitch. Or D. Hard nipples in any kind of weather. Player one's got it. Hard nipples in any kind of weather. Player one, you make the call. Pick a category. You've picked dirty jokes. And this question is worth $10,000. Complete this famous limerick. There once was a girl from Nantucket who sailed to France in a bucket, and when she got there, they asked for her fare, but she was flat broke. But the dumbass only spoke Nantucket. So she lifted her skirt and said, fuck it. Well, you know how the French are. Take it, player one! Uh, hello? So she lifted her skirt and said, fuck it. But they all just kind of, you know, held their nose like that. Player one, you make the call. Pick a category. You've picked historical fucks. And this question is worth $11,000. A castrato is a what? A Cuban national, a seller of castor oil, a castrated male singer, someone with the trot. Kick ass!
pass, player one. No good! Player one, you make the call. Pick a category.